and welcome. Today we've got this BHP 452. This is an old Makita brushed machine. This one's got an issue. There. You can hold it. So, the first thing we do if we get one of these is to open the back to see what the brushes are like. Well, a quick look will tell me that somebody has replaced the brushes in this in an attempt to try and fix it, but it hasn't done the job. The burn's okay, but we know the motor has expired. We need a new one. There's no melting on the uh, on the brush holder, so that's good. We can probably save that and the brushes. It's just a matter of placing this back to the motor. So we'll just start tearing this apart now to get out the business. Them brushes are brand new, so we can reuse them. They're sliding okay in the holder too, so that's important. We'll reuse that fill coil, we'll just clean it a little bit. This motor has obviously got cooked up. So here's the brand new one. It's going to replace that old one there. Give that a little blow out and a little, uh, little wipe down so it'll do the job. And we'll just put that new motor on. New armature on it, should I say. These are the two components of the motor, if you want to be very specific. That hasn't had any exceptional heating, so we'll, we'll be able to reuse that. This should be a good job when we're finished. There's little knots there. That has to go to the bottom, if you're doing one of these models yourself. That slot doesn't look that. Puts it all back together. Let's put a bat in and see what happens. Fair enough. Right? I just can't hold it the same, so it looks like she's fixed. Pretty good. Try a new one. I'm calling that fixed, so if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and check out the channel for all my other videos.